Womit. So long. We meet again. This thing, it's running like a dream. 
I gotta stop underestimating you, Builder. This should make all of our jobs easier. I wish we'd have thought to get one earlier. Let's call this the Bamna Machine, in remembrance of our old friend. We can change it if she comes back. So, you guys really believe we can make this work? You ain't gonna leave. No way. We're with you, boss. I don't have the motivation or ambition to seek betterment for myself. Oh, you guys. Bring it in. Ah, you two don't think you're getting away. <laughs> Thanks again, Builder. I think this machine you built for us has inspired some hope. Maybe in me more than anyone. I'm gonna try to do something nice for you too, alright? You keep an eye on your mailbox. Poking around the breach again? Just going for a walk. Don't tell me that's against the law now. No. Uh, the only walking that's against the law is jaywalking. But, uh, hey, point is, don't even think about going in there. We can't let Sizz through without proper training. I hate to be dramatic, but. I know that's meant to be rhetorical, but probably my dissertation. When is the breach going to be reopened to the public? I would like to look for more relics at some point. It'll open when it's open. Which is to say, when it's been reclassified as an abandoned ruins. And don't even think about trying to sneak in there. I wouldn't want to, but I do have the right to detain you if you're proven to be a danger to yourself. What's the basis for all these wild accusations? I walk down this way all the time. This imagined notion of me even thinking of sneaking into the breach is just that. Something you've just made up in your head. I also have to notice that the breach has been this way for quite some time. Normally, I would have expected you core type to have this handled already. Sir, if I may ask, is the stress getting to you? Hey, come on, give us a break. We've been up to our eyeballs in Geekless. Plus, there's Logan. Uh, yeah, it is getting to be a little rough out here, as a matter of fact. Glad somebody noticed. Aw, oh, poor Justice. Why don't you just take a day off? What you need is some rest. Then you'll have your edge back. I mean, at the very least. Surely you don't need to literally stand here in front of the breach. We all know not to go in. Yeah, maybe I could just head back to the office. Pour a big old glass of yak bell milk, kick up my heels and... Hey, wait a sec. Dang, how come every time I talk to you I end up with a headache? Look, Grace, I'm not kidding around. I take the safety of everybody in this town seriously. If something happened to you down there, I'd never forgive myself. Talk to me again when your fighting chops are up to snuff. Like, say, Builder's here. Hmm, right, right. How about this then? Oh, uh, well, no. I guess that'd all be pretty by the book in my book. I reckon it's on the two of you to work something out. I gotta keep it rolling. But I'm gonna have my eye on you. Maybe just 
adjust your stroll path to be a little less hair raising, all right? Y'all are going to be the death of me. Well, you heard the man. Looks like I don't need to sneak into the breach if I can recruit your help. The things I need are relatively simple. But I think I'd feel better if someone with an eye more discerning than that of a soldier's went in to look. So? Great! A bit of context. I'm an archaeology student in Atara, saving up to finish my degree. When I have time, I try to do field work that I hope will be beneficial for when I go back. You've been to the breach, right? Did you manage to pick up on what that place used to be? You know, back in the old world? Right, good one. Did you say that because you know and you want to be facetious? Or because you don't know and you're using humor to deflect? Well, in case of the latter, it used to be an office building. When it was open, the breach was a great place to look for archaeological finds and... Uh, right, you know the story. One of my main focuses is old-world audiovisual media. From salvaged memos and effects, I've discovered a concept discussed among Old World drones known as huke. I've surmised this term to mean listening to music at work. So, next time you're in the breach, just be on the lookout for Old World music-related media. Anything that seems vaguely relevant. Discs, posters... Also, I need some small chips from down there, too. For... reasons. Thanks again for agreeing to do this. I guess with you in the picture, everyone's lives are being made a little easier. Come find me when you've got some old world music stuff. And don't forget those small chips either, please. Hello! See ya! Thank you. 
The Shonash Canyon Bridge has always been our lifeline to much of the alliance of free cities. When it was destroyed, our survival hung in the balance. But when the going gets tough, sand rockers get tougher. We all played our part in rebuilding this bridge, but let's give a special round of applause for our core construction team. I would also like to thank the world-renowned businessman, Mr. Musa, as well as the Alliance of Free Cities for their generosity. Much of the budget for this bridge was donated by Mr. Musa after he heard about our predicament. Now with that out of the way, I call upon our own Dr. T to cut this here ribbon and hereby declare this bridge reopened. Has anyone seen Dr. Chi? Hey there. All right, catch you next time.